Hey guys, welcome back to Rocky Ridge Auto. We are here doing a walk around video on a 2019 Honda Odyssey. My name's Travis and uh, we'll be taking you inside and out. This is a 2019 EXL model. So the EXL comes with some extra features. Of course, you got privacy glass, got chrome door handles with proximity entry. It's got alloy rims on. The EXL comes with leather and sunroof. We'll take you inside and show you um, the interior features. Of course, you got power windows and door locks, memory seats. So you can program two different settings into that. Uh, this color interior is mocha. It's a real dark color and looks like it would be super easy to uh, keep clean. Got power seat. The controls are right there on the side of the seat for that. Here you got your power sliding doors, power gate, traction control, your lane change warning and your pre-collision braking. Those safety features are all right there. Take a seat behind the wheel and uh, power it up. It's got 21,000 miles on. There you go. It's hard to see with the sun glare there, but yeah, 21,250. Uh, so super low mileage. Gas is on the right and your cooling uh, gauge is on the left. On the steering wheel here, you got Bluetooth controls. This keypad here takes you right through your info center, which is up top. Um, so that is all controlled from right here. And then on the right side, you got your cruise control and it is adaptive cruise. So you can set your cruise and it'll maintain the same distance between you and the car in front of you. The car slows down in front of you. You'll slow down if it speeds up, it'll pick your speed up as well, up to your, to your max cruise setting. Um, the other thing on the steering wheel here, it's got the top, the paddle shifters. You see there's a minus on the right side there and then, or on the left side rather, and a plus on the right side. That is to shift in manually if you want to, to get into that mode. Um, I had pushed it once to put it in drive. We'll push it again. That puts it in the sport mode, which you can see the S right up top there. And, uh, and then uh, if you wanna shift it manually, simply just push the plus, then you're in manual two, because it was in manual one before. To go back down to one, you simply just push the minus here on the right side. So super easy. It's kind of like driving a stick shift, but no clutch. Um, but uh, there might be times when you wanna use that. Put it back in drive, you simply just push it again, or push the P, that puts you in park. Um, and then of course in reverse, you got the reverse camera, which pops up on the screen here. It's also got heated seats. It's got an econ mode for the transmission, snow setting as well. Um, up here in the infotainment center, and sorry, you're getting a little bit of a glare, um, but this is super easy to use. Um, everything is touch screen. It's got Android Auto, Apple CarPlay. You get your text messages, you get Bluetooth AI, or FM stereo, and then um, your phone settings as well. You get a phone call, you simply just touch the screen and it answers it for you. XM satellite radio, USB inputs, auxiliary inputs, all of those good things. Um, this is how you adjust your clocks. AM radio is right there as well. Um, and then of course your Honda links. That's pretty much the apps on it. Uh, but with the Android Auto and the Apple CarPlay, it's super convenient. You can use some apps on your phone and navigate, um, navigate through them right on the screen. Um, GPS is one of those apps. So the GPS app would show up right here and it's just like having built in GPS. So it's got dual climate control. That means you got driver and passenger. And then uh, of course you have rear con climate control as well. And that's, uh, that button's right there. Center console is huge. Two cup holders in the front, two in the back. There's some power outlets in the back, which we'll get to. Two power outlets inside as well, as well as the auxiliary input. Glove box, nice and spacious. Uh, it's got home link. So you got three settings here. You can program your garage door opener into, up to three different doors. The kids mirror, of course you gotta have that with a van. Um, sunroof controls are right here. It is one touch. You hit it once and it opens up. You don't have to hold it, which is super nice. We'll go ahead and close it. Same way with closing. You hit it once and it closes right up. And if you don't like the sunroof feature, you simply just keep the shade closed all the time and you should be all set. Take you into the middle row. So this is an eight seater. It's got two in the front, three in the middle, and then of course three in the back. Um, Go ahead and take a seat back here. Lots of space. Close the door. It's got the pull-out sunshades, 
which you can see right there. Uh, so not only does it have privacy glass, it's got the sun shades, and you can simply unhook that uh, if you don't want it, and it goes back down inside. Super convenient, nice big handles to get in and out. One of the coolest things about the Odyssey is their, how their seats work. Um, this, this lever right here is one of the handiest things, especially if you have kids in a car seat. So I'm gonna hold it with my D. You can, uh, you can tilt the whole seat forward, right like that. Makes it super easy to get in to the back. The reason you would do that is that um, your car seat can stay buckled in, so you don't have to take that in and out every time you want to fold the seat front. If you don't have car seats, it's also super easy. You simply just pull this lever, seat back folds front, and seat slides front, easy access into the back. Both sides work the same way. And if you don't want the middle seat or need the middle seat, you can take it out. So that gives you a nice aisle in the center as well. Obviously we're around the back. It's a power gate. I don't have the key on me. It's still up front in the cup holder. So I just simply push the button to open it up. But this rear seat folds down. These are super easy. It's uh, kind of just one strap. You simply just pull it back towards you and it folds up right like that, real easy. The interior of the van is super clean. It's in good shape. Got a button up top there. You, you can lower the hatch. Obviously we're making our way around the uh, passenger side. The exterior color is silver, and it's got a lot of metallic ends, pretty color. Under the hood, it is a 3.5 liter V6. Uh, comes with the Honda Earth Dreams technology, which is basically their fuel saving technology, and uh, does a great job for them. But overall, these are these are one of the best vans on the market. Come highly, come highly recommended from. Um, many sources as far as being reliable and just well thought out, well engineered, and overall a great van. Again, it's a 2019 Honda Odyssey EXL. Stop by and check it out. It's right here at Rocky Ridge Auto, 480 North Reading Road, effort at PA, 17522. Give us a call first just to make sure it's available, 717-733-8985. Thanks for watching. We'll see you soon.